So when you wake up in the morning and you just feel disconnected, it's because you're stuck in your masculine energy. That's what so many people don't realize is that you are actually stuck in your masculine energy. Masculine energy is fear and protection. And those are the two we're being kicked into on a daily, if not hourly basis. Fear of the unknown, fear of change. We're always in protection mode. Feminine energy is what gives birth. Feminine energy is the creator. So in this video, I'm gonna show you two powerful methods to use your masculine energy, to move back into your feminine energy, to become the power attractor for a total energetic transformation. The first emotion we're gonna be focused on is fear. I would do this every single day because we all live in a fearful state, okay? Fear of the unknown, fear of change. So let me share with you the science behind it because without intention you're just going through the motions you have to tell your mind where you want to go and how you're gonna get there our body has certain meridian points that are attached to certain organs where emotions get stuck so we're gonna be focusing on fear anger sadness and overthinking all the great things that move us from our feminine energy into our masculine energy all right before I show you the quick demo you guys I just want you to realize that both of these are very important you need to remove the emotional blockage of fear and you need to remove the emotional blockage of anger and overthinking especially when it comes to manifesting and getting what you want without clarity you cannot move towards your goal. And like I said, before you start your sessions, have the intention of what you're doing. You are moving trapped energy. You guys have to look at these trapped emotions like sludge in a tire. How long have they been stuck there? It's gonna take quite a bit of intensity to get this energy in motion. So if you aren't sore, by the time you get done with these sessions, you aren't going hard enough. I'm a go hard or go home type personality. You don't have to do high jumps. You can jump rope in place. You don't even need a jump rope. You can do air jumps. I just want you landing symmetrically on your feet so that when you land, you're shoving the energy into your feet. You're grounding the energy while hitting the meridian points that's removing the emotional blockage of fear. So you choose what you wanna do. The full session is two minutes. I will link it at the end of the video. With that said, let's go ahead and go up to the rooftop. Before every session, I expand my energy as much as possible by opening my arms wide and setting my intention with this affirmation. I am the architect of my life. I delete the world of victim and claim my power. In three, two, one, begin. Jumping activates the kidney meridian where fear gets trapped. When you jump and you land on both feet, it does a few things. Number one, it gets you out of your head and into your body. Number two, it grounds your energy. It shoves your energy into the ground while at the same time, it hits the meridian point that's attached to your kidney where fear gets emotionally trapped. Let me show you exactly where it is, hold on. So when you land, it hits, oh, my feet is so dirty, it hits this right here. That's the actual meridian point that you're hitting. You guys have to understand that your emotions are encoded with purpose. So if you feel an emotion starting to gain momentum and you don't answer the call, you are ignoring your internal guidance system. Something is trying to surface so that it can be cleared because the body is always seeking balance. Before I move into demoing the second movement and why we're doing it, I want you guys to download the free audio that you're listening to in these sessions. I want it to be fun. Create a mini mindset session for yourself. You have to have methods that you circle back to every time you go through a breakup, every time you experience a disappointment. You have to have something in place. Staying in your feminine energy is a practice, it is a lifestyle because we are constantly thrown into our masculine. Every time something happens, that's what the masculine energy is for. All right, ladies, with that said, let's move on to the second movement, which is going to be throwing some punches yes we're going to be throwing punches and again this needs to be done with intensity you want to get shredded start working on your mental health using my methods and you will have the most banging winter body you can possibly imagine so punches activate the liver lung heart and spleen you're hitting all the meridian points in your torso these organs are where sadness anger and overthinking get trapped sink to my rhythm sink to my intensity and don't forget the intention when you do this before you start you are not just punching you are clearing focus on what you're clearing close your eyes get into the zone look at the video look how I am I'm laser focused because I'm visualizing what I'm clearing what I'm afraid of I am punching it I am moving that energy to make space I delete the role of victim and reclaim my power 
in three, two, one, begin. And if you're thinking to yourself that this doesn't feel very feminine, this punching and this jumping feels like masculine energy. That's why the intention is important. You're intentionally using your masculine energy to remove emotional blockages. And the goal isn't to stay in your masculine energy. It's just to use the masculine energy to remove the block, preventing you from softening into your feminine energy. And we need our feminine energy for creation. We need our feminine energy to manifest. If you found this video helpful, you're going to want to watch this one because movement alone is not enough. You also need to shift your mind from focusing on the problem to focus on the possibility and that's where the audio comes into play you guys have to stack my methods if you want to create an internal shift which will create the external change that you're looking for if you want to do the full session with me which is approximately two minutes go ahead and click that and if you want a one-on-one -on -one customized session contact me in the description box below and I will see you guys next